As National Parks traveler Micah Meyer moved through the enchanting landscape of New Mexico, he was overwhelmed by its many natural and man-made wonders. At the Gila Cliff Dwellings National Monument, he walked among the ruins of homes that once belonged to the region's indigenous peoples. What makes them so unique to all the other cliff dwellings in the park system are that the public is actually allowed to walk up into these caves. Heading northeast, Micah made a quick stop at Salinas Pueblo Missions National Monument, one of many Spanish missions in the American Southwest meant to bring Christianity and Spanish culture to the native people. It's these adobe brick structures that have survived since the era of the Spanish arrival to the Pueblo culture. Other wonders awaited Micah at Almalpais National Monument, known for its massive sandstone bluffs. You can climb on all these massive boulders and jump from boulder to boulder. Such a unique climbing experience and you feel like a five-year-old again discovering a new land. Petroglyph National Monument near Albuquerque is home to thousands of symbolic stone drawings that were carved onto volcanic rocks by Native Americans and Spanish settlers 400 to 700 years ago. There are so many faces and shapes and animals that nobody really knows what they were used for. If it was a sacred location, if it was a historical notation system for the natives, nobody really knows. What is known is just how close modern homes have been built next to the ancient site. The development was coming so close to this old native history area that that's really what encouraged the local community to try to protect it. Close to the city of Santa Fe is Bandelier National Monument, which Micah described as a mini Grand Canyon, with one little difference. It's in a valley between two very stark, tall canyon walls. And as you look at the canyons, there's all these holes, which were little dwellings. People once lived in the carved out spaces in those canyon walls. And in some areas, they built stone houses outside of it. It's just a really nice mix of beautiful landscapes and historical information. The highlight of Micah's recent journey, however, was the Capulin Volcano National Monument, a former cone volcano that exploded long ago, allowing modern visitors like Micah to get up close to one of nature's most powerful forces. So you can see the old lava flows behind me, but I am in the middle of the Capulin Volcano right now, descending to the very bottom. Behind me, you can see the upper ridge, which I'll hike around after this. One of my favorite views from the Capulin Volcano Rim Hike, you can see the vast amount of green trees that populate this high, arid desert. Micah looks forward to visiting other National Park site wonders as he continues his travels through the land of enchantment, the state of New Mexico. Julie Tabo, VOA News, Washington.